Bonjour. Hi, hello, welcome back to my channel guys And today is another painting and chit chat video I think this is what, episode 3, 4? I don't know, we'll figure it out in the title But yeah, just painted on Bulma And um <laughs> I know it's been a little while I think it's been over a month since the last time I posted here on my YouTube channel Work's been a little stressful J -j just a little bit because of the holidays and whatnot But here I want to keep positive vibes here on my channel So yeah, I actually went ahead and drew her like off camera Because originally I was just going to film like just like a little TikTok and a YouTube short But I decided to go ahead and like film myself completely painting her Just, you know, I miss uploading on YouTube I It's been a while, I think it's been like a little over a month I hate to leave you guys hanging But you know, like I said, work's been stressful I haven't had time to really sit down and film Oh, and just like Real quick, little cameo appearance. This is one of my gatitos. His name is Nacho. I named him after Nacho Varga or Ignacio Varga from Better Call Saul, one of my favorite characters. I actually made Better Call Saul nails like a while ago. Like a little, yeah, a little over a year ago whenever like the season finale, I just never uploaded because I never filmed a tutorial. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like you guys don't really like my tutorials, which I mean, yeah, I'm not a nail tech or anything. I know my nail art isn't the best, but oh well. <laughs> It is what it is. Like I said, I try to see like a silver lining, positive outlook on life. I was very like this year has been such a roller coaster. Oh my goodness! Like all of last year and the begin most of this year, it's just been chaotic in my personal life. Once again, I had some toxic people in my life, but uh, yeah, they're gone now, so it's all good. Positive vibes. <laughs> um, yeah. So. I have been painting lately, if you guys see like on my YouTube shorts or you follow me on my TikTok It's kind of a mix over there, kind of like my YouTube channel Yeah, I love painting, I used to paint all the time as a kid, you know Back when life was simpler, the economy was in somewhat decent shape, um, housing market in particular <laughs> I'm totally kidding, well not really, but anyways, we're not going to get political here But uh, yeah, so I have so many plans, so many things, so many dreams and aspirations I want to do, but I can't because just like life happens, you know? But one thing that's kind of like my escape besides the nail art and gaming and of course, you know, spending time with my six cats is painting. I am not like, I don't ever plan on really going to art school or anything like that, and by no means am I a professional, but that's the glory of art. You can just kind of paint, draw, sketch, Whatever you fancy. Oh, by the way, I have to protect this tablecloth, otherwise, you know. <laughs> Boyfriend will be mad at me. So I'm just laying down this super one grocery dill. As if I can even afford groceries. So I'm just gonna put my, uh, the bowl of canvas on top just so no black acrylic paint gets on that tablecloth. I know what you're thinking. Why am I painting in the kitchen? I was baking something. I can't remember if I was making brownies or if I was cooking some like shrimp scampi. Honestly, I can't remember. I filmed this video or... I filmed the footage a while ago, and I just, like I said, I've been busy, so I'm just now doing the voiceover over all this. Don't you love when you buy a canvas and it has like a whoopsie daisy? <laughs> it's all good, that's what I like about acrylic paint, I can always cover up any blemishes on my canvases. I'm just gonna tear the bandaid right off and just say, I've never been really good at painting on or drawing anime characters, even though I love anime and I watch it like 25A, but you can still like tell it's Bulma, and in the end I liked how she looked, because that's the best I could do. <laughs> but yeah, um... I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I'm not like the biggest Dragon Ball Z fan. I mean, I like the anime, but my favorite animes are obviously like Inuyasha, Sailor Moon, Naruto, Medai Nikki, so... I remember I started like a little anime nail art series here on my channel, or at least I attempted to get it off the ground. However, my hands are not as steady as they used to be back whenever I was interested in pursuing nail art as a career. Or, you know, to be a nail tech and whatnot. So my hands tend to get a little shaky and I just butcher the butcher the nail art, so yeah. I haven't really filmed any nail art, like, lately. I think the last nail art I filmed was the Blossom Chucky nail art, and that was, like, what, over a month ago? But yeah. Lately, I've just been doing, like, one single coat and just keeping my nails simple. Um, yeah. But I have been focusing more on my paintings and whatnot, and, uh, like I said, if you see my shorts or you follow me on my TikTok or even on my Instagram, you can see that, uh, yeah. Whenever I get the chance, which is like super rare, like I said, I work all the time, well over 40 hours a week, but when I do get a chance and the house is clean and all my chores are done and then all the housewife stuff is taken care of, yeah, I like to paint and it's something I really enjoy doing. Um, I actually always enjoyed doing it, but then I just stopped for some reason. Even to myself, I'm like, why did I ever stop? I love painting. <laughs> So, I don't know exactly what it was, and I'm not gonna trauma dump on you guys, but I was, uh... I was at my lowest that I've ever been, ever, in my life. This time, 
last year. So, uh, just kind of for like an escape, um, I couldn't color my hair because it was still damaged. I was a brunette at the time. My nails, I couldn't, like my hands were a little, very, very, very unsteady, so I couldn't get the nail art down. Couldn't afford a tattoo and piercings are no go for me. So instead, I ended up finishing a Grand Theft Auto, like a GTA canvas that I started for like over a year and then left it like unfinished on my wall for a while. Well, I finished it and I don't know exactly what happened, but like a, like a little switch went off and reignited my passion for painting and artwork and doing canvas art. So this is not set in stone. Like I said, every time I have like a dream or an interest or I want to do something, stuff happens. <laughs> really trying to watch my language just for numerous reasons. Um, I really don't, I mean, when I was younger, especially when I was on Xbox Live, I would just swear all the time, swear like a sailor, as they used to say. And not that I'm like against cursing and everything, I mean, I am an adult, but at the same time, I really want to watch my language, not curse all the time, so. Yeah, instead of saying the uh, F word, the whole word, I'm just gonna say fluff, makes life easier. But yeah, <laughs> so yeah, stuff happens, life happens, but it is what it is, and uh, yeah, the point I'm trying to get at is, I did set up an Etsy account back in late 2021, early 2022. Patrick Star, the contents of my mind, or of Enigma, because honestly I can't even remember. Um, what I do know is, you know, over the suggestion from my boyfriend, he suggested that I sell like some like false nails. Yeah, just to paint over and sell instead of me like actually being in the salon, which is still an idea I want to do, just right now it's on a low burner. Um, yeah, <laughs> seriously, do you see... The little um, Super One paper I have advertising all these groceries. Dude, it's so expensive. But yeah, um, <laughs> you can tell it's Bulma. I know, like I said, I'm not the best when it comes to painting on anime characters. But uh, as you see, I try my best and that's all you can really do. <laughs> so I noticed recently, um, I haven't been posting any videos here on my YouTube channel because I've been working. I work retail, so YouTube is not exactly like a job. For me, it's a hobby, which don't get me wrong, I like filming content and everything, it's just, you know, yeah. <laughs> My actual, like, job, per se, that I actually make an income from, yeah, it's been occupying, occupying, oh my god, I can't talk, <laughs> most of my time. Like, I have ring cameras and all that good stuff, so there was no, like, porch pirates or anything like that. I don't know, sometimes, like, stuff happens, I get it, we're all human, we all make mistakes, but, like, I want my nail art gems. <laughs> Guys, I miss posting content, like, doing makeup tutorials on TikTok, just no voiceover. <laughs> Learned that the hard way. <laughs> Oh, um, I miss doing Neller, I miss doing painting videos, it's just, you know, yeah, I work for a living. <laughs> like, YouTube and pretty much any social media, as much as I do enjoy doing it, it's a nice little hobby, a nice little kickback. It is not like, I don't make any, like, income, I just do it for the fun because, you know, it's fun. Um, I like posting content, I like that when you guys enjoy my content, you leave me nice comments about how, you know, you rather like my voice, or a lot of y'all actually don't, but <laughs> regardless, you like my nail art, you like just, you know, nice little background noise, what have it, just, if you're a subscriber, or even if you're new to my channel, hi, hello, welcome, um, my YouTube channel, my YouTube channel, <laughs> my YouTube channel's name is babybats23, but you can call me Jamie, that's like my actual name in real life, so what to expect from this channel, uh, it's kind of all over the place, but predominantly, I'm a nail art channel, or just an art channel. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm trying to get into gaming once I figure out how to actually edit my content. I've already filmed videos to, like, do, like, Fallout, like, Fallout 4 and all that good stuff, but, uh, yeah, I need some Adobe Premiere or something like that. But anyways, um, been rambling this entire video. <laughs> uh, here is my Bulma painting. Like I said, it doesn't look exactly like Bulma, but you can still tell it's her. And now, my favorite part after I finish a canvas is I like to watermark it. So, most people have their own, like, they just put, like, their initials in the corner and everything. However, I like to paint, like, a little heart as well as my name, Jamie, underneath the canvas as, like, my watermark for the, um, yeah, whatever painting I do. You like all my blankets? It's currently, like, December in Texas. It's really cold. And this is one, one of my cats. I got six. This is one of them. His name is Lalo, and he occupied all my blankets. So... <laughs> I have to stand up and do this, but, uh, yeah, got some Mod Podge, um, I have since invested in some Liquitex, but I have, like, I don't know, it's in the other room, but, uh, I have, like, three or four Mod Podge, like, little containers that I need to use, so, yeah, 
Just gonna finish off my canvas with this kind of seal it. Um, honestly, I prefer Mod Podge when I do puzzles, but it's been like so long since I've done puzzles, so yeah. But it's fine, it's fine. I can use it on my, my art canvases, it's fine. If you saw that soda can, you're wondering what like that black stain was, and you're thinking like, oh my god, did Jamie just eat black acrylic paint? No, no, no. It's um, NYX black uh, lipstick? Lip gloss? I don't know. My boyfriend likes when I wear black lipstick, but it transfers really bad, so yeah. But I have made a pact. I am not drinking any soda. Well, as much soda, I'm not gonna lie. Uh, nobody really talks about a soda addiction, um, but it's all good, it's all good. I mainly drink water and, like, tea and everything, like Milo's tea, but, uh, yeah. Got a little bit of a Dr. Pepper addiction, so I'm working on it though. At the time of filming this, I haven't drank a soda at all in a week, which is pretty good. Especially for a Texan. <laughs> All jokes aside, uh, yeah, um, like I said, this year started off kind of meh, uh, but I see the glasses half full, everything all worked out, uh, I'm where I need to be, and I am so excited, I made it through another year, you know, everyone I care about, we all made it through, and, um, yeah, I just, uh, here's a 2024, hopefully everything's so much better, <laughs> so excited for next year, um, of course I have to get a printer, and printer's ink and all that good stuff, but, uh, yeah, I can't wait to start selling with my canvas art and everything, so, I know you guys, like, some of you have been messaging me, like, DMing me on Instagram, asking if I'm selling anything, and currently I'm not, but still, um, yeah, in the future, I'll let everybody know when I am, but, uh, ooh, I like how Bulma looks, you know, guys, you be honest with me, does it look like her? <laughs> but, um, yeah, I really hope you enjoyed today's video, as well as the canvas art, and thank you so much if you made it to the end, may all your pillows be cold at night, hope you have a wonderful day, and thanks for watching!